Fantastic 5 Tips to Gain Weight Without Belly Fat Gain Gaining weight is as important as losing a few extra pounds. We share 5 recommendations to achieve your goal without gaining belly. Gaining weight is very easy, but doing it without gaining belly is more complicated. We assure you that winning pounds in a healthy way is even more difficult than eliminating them, and this is true for most people. Gaining weight is a complex process in which the scale is not the best ally to measure our evolution, nor is the body mass index BMI. To achieve satisfactory results it is necessary to perform an analysis of our body to determine what the ideal weight is. Before taking any action, it is advisable to consult a nutritionist, as he will be the one who guides you throughout the process. Thus, the main objective will be to find a formula so that the weight gained is due to an increase in muscle mass and not fat gain. BMI, the spearhead. The first step you should take to gain weight properly is to calculate your body mass index. With the BMI it is basically determined if a person suffers from overweight, obesity or low weight. To calculate it, divide your weight in weight between the square of your size in meters, kilogram per meter too. 5 Tips to Gain Weight Without Gaining Belly Increasing pounds by gaining muscle mass is more complicated than doing it at the expense of increasing body fat. And this is a factor that makes many people gain belly. Those who are considering gaining weight believe that the only way to achieve this is by eating uncontrollably, but this is false. In this process the food intake should not be exaggerated, but controlled. The specialist states that the nutritional plan must be well prepared with healthy foods. These foods must be able to be combined in a correct way. 1. Each meal should contain a portion of complex carbohydrates. Both at breakfast, lunch and dinner there must be a source of complex carbohydrates, since these provide the elemental energy that our body needs. If they are incorporated in their proper measure, they will allow the proteins to fulfill their functions, which are, repair muscles and tissues. Help growth. The nutritionist notes that you can incorporate whole grains and their derivatives with legumes. The rice, pasta or cuckoos is a good choice. Also, cereals, rice, oats, corn, wheat, millet, etc., nuts, cereal bars, wholemeal bread, and healthy snacks that combine these options. 2. More quality proteins. To gain weight the proteins are fundamental, because they are a source of amino acids, which are responsible for stimulating the growth hormone segregation. It is necessary that if you want to gain weight you can contemplate in your diet a safe, and proportionate contribution of proteins. The egg whites are the reference in terms of protein of animal origin, since they are the most complete. Regarding proteins of vegetable origin, what matters is their proper combination, cereals and legumes or cereals and nuts. 3. Add nuts and seeds. Adding these foods can serve as an appetizer to satiate the appetite. Combine them with a toast of bread in the form of cream, or eat them as cereal bars. This offers the ideal combination of nuts and cereals, so it can be an excellent source of protein. 4. Carbohydrates plus proteins. This combination is necessary to do it in the main meals or previous to the exercise sessions. The reason is that both groups of macronutrients help in the generation of muscle mass and will help you gain weight. 5. Vitamins are important. The vitamins will help to mesh the whole process, because they provide nutrients that the body cannot synthesize on its own. So to gain weight eat whole grains, legumes, lean meats and egg whites. All these options are rich in vitamins and their combination will provide your body with the proteins and carbohydrates necessary to not gain belly in this whole process. Now, if you have any doubt, remember to consult a nutritionist. He will give you the best recommendations according to the characteristics of your body. It is very possible that you also need a special training plan, the specialist can help you with it as well. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.